Well, high winds tomorrow. That's going to make for some high wave action. So the National Weather Service went ahead with a lakeshore flood advisory. It begins at 10 a.m. in the morning. Those north and northeast winds could gust 15 to 25 miles per hour, building the waves six to nine feet, creating a lakeshore flood threat. Now, cloudy skies, cool conditions. That's the forecast. We have Hurricane Zeta. Winds are still at 80 miles per hour. It's pulling through Alabama. Look at the cloud shield reaching us. Rain won't reach us, but the cloud shield will. Now, the rain we expect tomorrow is confined to the lakefront. A 20% chance of just an instability shower near the lake. High temperatures mainly in the 40s. And we should touch 50 degrees for a moment in the afternoon, but otherwise planned for 40s. Look at the waves building as we get into the late day hours. In fact, by the time the sun goes down, that's when we're going to see those waves building six to nine feet. So really increasing throughout the course of the day. So only 50 with a stray shower tomorrow. Friday, that's our day to clear out, but it does look rather cool. Saturday for Halloween looking nice. You know, it's a full moon that night, a blue moon because it's the second full moon this month and our temperature may flirt with 60 in the afternoon heading into Halloween evening. Then a cold front comes through and that really takes the temperature down on Sunday. Only 44 with high winds. Look at next week though, Brad, warming up, especially by the middle of the week. I'd like to see that. Thanks, MK.